Everyone, welcome to the show. So former Trump administration official Miles Taylor is out with a new book. It contains some very disturbing allegations against Donald Trump. You guys might remember Taylor. He was the Trump staffer who published that anonymous op-ed in the New York Times. He said that he and others were inside of the Trump administration resisting him. There was this big uproar about it. Well, in his new book, it's called Blowback, A Warning to Save Democracy from the Next Trump. Taylor says that Trump's actions and words were so overtly sexist and wildly inappropriate that other people were all talking about it. Other staff members, other high ups in his administration had to correct him at times. He writes that in regard to Trump, quote, Aide said he talked about Ivanka Trump's breasts, her backside, and what it might be like to have sex with her. Remarks that once led former Chief of Staff John Kelly to remind the president that Ivanka was his daughter. Taylor added, quote, afterward, Kelly retold that story to me in visible disgust. Trump, he said, was, quote, a very, very evil man. I mean, this is nothing new, right? I mean, we've all heard stuff like this, but it's absolutely vile and vomit-inducing. I mean, we know he has said in public appearances that if Ivanka wasn't his daughter, he'd be dating her. So so gross. It, he made heinous remarks also about his other daughter, about Tiffany, when she was an infant. You can go look that up. I think it was a, an interview. If I'm not mistaken, it was with Barbara Walters. He was talking about her as an infant, about how she has her mother's legs and how he hoped that she would get her mother's and then he like motioned to her breasts. Who says that? about their own daughter and a, an infant and not in jest he was asked once i think it was on the view you know what what do you and ivanka have most in common and he said sex he is a sick sick man it, he is so amoral so repugnant and yet so many right-wing quote-unquote christians still support him. True Christians don't support this man. Taylor also said that Trump's sexism was directed at everyone at all levels of government, including cabinet secretaries. Evidently, Trump used to call Kirsten Nielsen sweetie and honey, and he critiqued her makeup. And Nielsen, as you guys all know, probably, he would, she was the Secretary of Homeland Security. But I mean, that doesn't even matter, right? What, what level of the government she was in. It's a business. It is a job. It is, this is, you know, you're working with someone. It, why are you calling them sweetie and honey? You don't do that to the men, right? Um, and at one point, it, Taylor says that Nielsen apparently whispered to him, quote, this is not a healthy workplace for women. Yet she stayed. Um, Taylor also claims that Trump former aide Kellyanne Conway referred to Trump as a, quote, misogynistic bully. Now, she, of course, denies that because, you know, she's got to keep getting that paper, right, Kellyanne Conjob? <laughs> so anyway, guys, totally disgusting. Just like I said, stomach churning, vomit inducing that you would say such things about your own child. There is something wrong with him. Seriously, why 30% of this country cannot see it? I mean, I don't know. Maybe they don't know this stuff. Maybe they really just don't know. It's up to us. We got to put it in their faces. And if they still go for it, I mean, they can't ever, ever talk about Democrats being sick perverts. And, you know, Joe Biden sniffing little girl's hair. Seriously? Not when you want to do your own daughter. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please donate if you can.
If the links are down below in the description box on YouTube and on the podcast, greatly appreciate it. Love you all. Take care and I'll talk with you soon. <laughs>